Nal Sabila. I'm from Second C Grad English Education Study Program in Sri Avanjan University. And this video, I want to analyze the short story with the title "An Angel in This Cave." But before we start to analyze this short story, I want to tell you about extrinsic and intrinsic elements, and I put the meaning of extrinsic and intrinsic elements from the uh, from the it. And extrinsic elements of literature was about the things that can really be found inside the story itself. It wasn't the material, but the facts and information that supports and surrounds the story. It could tell about the other inspirations, life experience, and act. It could also tell about the world situations, past, present, or maybe the future, and many other supporting facts. And the kinds of extrinsic elements are other life, historical background, cultural background, and social background. And the uh, intrinsic elements in literature, usually we can find it inside the story itself. We can analyze it easily because all of the facts are inside the books. It could tell about the characters, plot, setting, moral message, scenes, and act. That are the meaning of extrinsic and intrinsic elements. And now we can see extrinsic and intrinsic element of the third story. Extrinsic elements of story it have strong vocabulary, complex sentence, realistic setting. The story views on the importance of love and care in one's life. How long drives out even the darks and deepest bitters out of a person? And the reality of our society in a star like it's Evelyn cross the judgmental eyes and reproachfulness pull towards literally everything, the description couldn't be more realistic. And the word angel in the title of the story refers to the small girl child and his name is Maggie who brings love and joy for the Thompson family. They will be acting as an angel in disguise for them. So the story starts with a negative and gloomy scene toward the end Maggie's innocence, Joe, kindness and Mr. Thompson's love will make you smile. And the intrinsic of the story are characters, and the characters is there are John, Cat, Maggie, their mother, Farmer, Mrs. Ellis, Joe Thompson, and Jen Thompson. All the characters are really strong, be it the villager or the kid, they have been given their own from point of view, be it good or bad. Each character strikes a chord in your heart with others, it don't write closely or with its kindness and unconditional love. Like uh, Maggie. Maggie was the youngest of the three children two years before her mother's death. She fell out of a window and injured her spine. She couldn't move unless someone picked her up. And the sad thing. The setting it took place in a small village many years ago, but there's no mentions of the place. But from the descriptions, we can conclude that it's a rural area with a small population because all the villagers seem to know each other quite well, and it's crystal clear that the people are the right narrow minded. And the theme. The theme in the story is people can change, they might have certain beliefs, but these beliefs may change if circumstance their life change. And that's enough for me, I'm sorry for my mistake, and thank you for watching, wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.